Hey, it's Dan with The Verge, and I'm checking out Lenovo's new lineup of Fab phones being announced at Techworld this week. The company's announcing three new models, the Fab 2, the Fab 2 Plus, and the Fab 2 Pro, all of which will be available in the US later this summer. The Fab 2 and the Fab 2 Plus are updates of last year's Fab, and feature giant 6.4-inch displays, big batteries, and aluminum designs. The $199 Fab 2 has a 720p display and quad-core MediaTek processor, while the $299 Fab 2 Plus steps up to a 1080p screen, an octa-core chip, and throws in a fingerprint sensor and dual camera array. Both of those are going to be available unlocked directly from Lenovo when they launch. But the most interesting member of the family is the $499 Fab 2 Pro. It's the first consumer device with Google's Tango technology, and it has a special camera array, including a main 16 megapixel sensor, wide angle camera, and infrared depth sensing camera. Lenovo has actually shrunk down the Tango hardware into a phone form factor here, and it's noticeably smaller than the developer Tango tablets we've seen in the past. As far as phone specs go, the Fab 2 Pro has a Quad HD 6.4 inch screen, Qualcomm Snapdragon 652 processor, 4GB of RAM, and a 16 megapixel camera. It's without a doubt a large, kinda thick, and pretty heavy phone, but it's still smaller than earlier Tango devices. The special cameras work together with the phone's gyroscopes and accelerometer to map out spaces, and it can actually locate the device within that space. If you walk around a room with a Fab 2 Pro, it knows exactly where you are in that room and in relation to other objects in the space. Lenovo is showing off a couple of Tango experiences that will be available on the Fab 2 Pro when it launches, including an educational dinosaur app that was made in partnership with the American Museum of Natural History, a virtual domino app that lets you create these Rube Goldberg-like contraptions wherever you are, and a first-person shooter that lets you gun down robots in a virtual environment. The Dinosaur app lets you place a virtual creature in real space and then look at it from a variety of angles by moving the phone around the dinosaur and then tap on specific points to learn more about it. Lenovo says that there will be about 25 apps available for the Tango features in the Fab 2 Pro when it launches, including games, utilities, and location-based experiences, and they're expected to be 100 apps by the end of the year. All three phones are expected to be available later this summer, and we'll have more info to share on them once we spend more time with them. For more on the Fab 2 lineup and everything else being announced at TechWorld, be sure to check us out at TheVerge.com. Kelly, get out of the camera shot. <laughs>